In this video, I want to show you a great way to add a clickable link to like your website or your mobile app within any website that you ever go to, as long as they allow it. Some websites won't. So first thing I did is came to Sniply.com. It's S-N-I-P dot L-Y. And I signed up for a free account. There's also paid accounts where it lets you have multiple profiles and all kinds of great things. This is just a really neat tool I've been using for a long time, um, mainly because right now I want people to download my Kelloims mobile app. So first thing is, once you set up your profile first, then what do you want to call to action? And then you create a link to any website. So with the brand profile, I've already got a brand profile. So if I come here to brand profiles, here's my brands. I get one brand with a free account. And I'll show you what I did to edit it. It's just going to be simple. What's the photo? So make it a square because notice it turns into a circle of your logo. I've got the J Team South Florida Real Estate with my Keller Williams logo. I've got the name, the J Team Keller Williams Fort Lauderdale. Let's change that to Keller Williams Realty Professionals. I've got my website address here. So that way, if they ever click the profile, it will take them to my website. That's step one. Step two is creating what we call your call to action. So this allowed you to have a couple. So this is my main one I'm using right now, which is I want them to download my mobile app, which will say search homes on the go and save thousands. Click here to download our mobile app. So this is the ability to create that. So I'm going to manage it and how this is going to work is when you come to edit that conversion, it starts with these four simple steps. What's your message? So this would be the search homes on the go and save thousands. What's the button say? Click here to download, right? Or I could just leave it with download our free mobile app. There we go. And then what is the link? Now this should be a link to your mobile app. So you can get that from your mobile app. I've already got it on my website. So I'm going to open this in a new tab. Here is my link to my mobile app and I'm going to put that there. Perfect. Now it's going to ask you which theme. So you've got social, full width will take the whole banner, candy, kind of pops up as one thing, and then they've got Bean as well. So I kind of like social, but you can make it whichever one. Full width, so it's always there, meaning when they scroll on this page, it's always got that banner. How about I do that one? You can also change the background color if you want to. Now see, that's a pro feature. See how these are locked. So for free, I'm gonna leave it as it is. Finish call to action. Go to call to action, and now it is now my new link. So there's the link. This is what it's going to look like now when I preview it. Download our free mobile app. Now, I've already done a few of these, so now I will show you how do you create a snap for that. So, or a snip. I've already got a post that I want to grow for my website. So this is the post I want to drive them to, and I want them to see this on social media and go to my consumer site. So no matter what website you go to, you would come here, you would paste the link there, create a snip, now this is gonna preview it for you, so it's gonna bring it in. Here's the post, it's checked that it's good. Which call to action do I wanna use? So I'm gonna say search homes on the go, download our free mobile app. Here it is, so that will be the banner. And when I snip this, now what it's doing is putting the website together and there. So here's my link, I can copy this, and I'll show you now when I go to that web page, it's gonna add that banner at the bottom that says search mobile homes on the go. Now notice, it stays there the whole time. So this is really good if it was something like on mobile, right? Because I would see that link no matter what I'm looking at. So imagine using this for a real estate article you want or something that the National Association of Realtors posted. Typically, it takes them to their website with this banner. They can click this link and it will download your mobile app on their mobile device. So that's how to use Sniply. I love using it. It gives you a dashboard that will tell you how many people have clicked What's your conversion rate if you are tracking that? So you can see here, this post for a listing got a lot of clicks to download the mobile app. Some of these other ones with iBuyers, different blog posts I've had, and then it gives you some cool metrics here on the right of what they've done. So that's how to use Sniply to engage your social media and post the links that you want to share with the ability to download your mobile app. Thanks for watching. If you found value in this, please give it a like. Leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And as always, follow me on KB Connect today.